below is the extreme sounds and we're going to do an installation of the OCZ Agility Free SSD. So first you take out the battery and then you lift off the cover after unscrewing two screws. Here we've got the old hard drive, it's a 750 gig um, Hitachi hard drive. I'm just going to take this out. It's quite tricky, but you have to be very careful because the SAS connection is quite um, vulnerable. So we've got some rubber pads on this, and we're going to take the front ones off and just slide that onto the OCZ SSD. Right, so I've put the SSD in and I've installed it, and we're going to do a boot test after I've tweaked it all, okay? And this is my really cool custom background I made. And there we go, we booted. And I don't know at the moment how quick it is, but I'll have a clock in the camera there with my editing software. If you don't know, the really good things with SSDs are they run cooler, they're a huge amount faster, they don't use as much energy, so you get more battery life, and if you drop them, they don't break as easily because it's there's not there's no moving parts at all. So because SSDs are really quick, it means that if you click on Word on a normal hard drive, it will come up with this box like that and it will be really slow. But with this, it's instant. Same with Sony Vegas. It would take quite a, f quite a while to open on a hard drive because it's lots to load. But it's very, really quick with this. Sorry the screen's gone a bit weird on under the camera, but the rating for hard drive on this is 7.4 out of 7.9 so it's really up there with all the others all the high end SSDs. With a normal hard drive you'd be getting around like 50 megabits per second speed which is like normal that's good but this SSD from OCZ the Agility 3 has 600 megabits per second speed. Unfortunately though I had to get the 60 gig version which means I have a bit of cleaning to do. Thank you very much for watching, that has been an installation of the OCZ Agility 3 SSD and well, as you can see it's really improved my laptop and you get more battery life as well. So I'll be enjoying this and if I have any more cool things I've realised with this SSD I'll show you and thank you, goodbye.